lips and cry. Bringing you Aqua Beats, Hello Kitty Barrette Set. Not only are we gonna make cool Hello Kitty bead art, but we could turn them into hairpins. Awesome! The back of the box shows everything that comes with this playset. Before I begin, I'm happy to announce that Awesome Dizzy Toys is now on Instagram, Facebook, and Twitter. Be sure to follow all three social media sites to keep up with all the awesome things I'll be doing. I'll even be posting up some behind the scenes photos, so be sure to click on the links below to follow me. Let's open it up! We get a beat tray. Here's the layout tray. Let's take a look at the templates. Here's the Hello Kitty one. Here's a Rila Kuma one. Hello Kitty's twin sister Mimi. And another Hello Kitty template. Let's check out the Aqua Beads. What's really cool about this set is that we get three jewel beads to work with. Here's an original white colored bead. This is a red jewel bead, a yellow jewel bead, and a green jewel bead. And then we have blue, pink, black, and orange. Here's the bead pen. And the sprayer. Here are three different size Barretts. I know this set provides us with a clear bead tray, but I wanted to bring back the Hello Kitty Sparkle case from the previous video. Because let's be honest, it's much cooler than the regular tray. I'd like to mention you could click on the eye on the top right corner if you haven't watched the first Aqua Beats Hello Kitty video. Be sure to check it out! Oh! I wanted to show you guys something! When the Hello Kitty case is closed, you could shake it all you want. And your beads will stay nicely in place, so you won't have to worry about your case being messy if you take it around. Let's start with this Hello Kitty template. Give this video a thumbs up if you're a fan of Hello Kitty and Aqua Beads. Nice! Our Hello Kitty's done! Time to make this cake! We'll give it a spray. And once you're done spraying, be sure to let it dry. The jewel beads adds a nice touch to the bead art. What do you guys think? This is a fancy looking cake! 
when your bead art is completely dry, you could add it onto your Barret. If you wear this to school or a special event, I'm sure people will be asking you where you got it, and people will be more impressed if you say you made it. You just clip it on like this. And now you have a pretty Hello Kitty Barret. It's pretty easy to clip on, so I don't think you'll have any issues. I'm almost done making Rila Kuma too. Nice! What do you guys think about this one? And here's a house made of jewels. That must be nice. The Rila Kuma Barret looks really pretty too. Oh, it went upside down. Would you guys wear this one, or the Hello Kitty one? Well this was a lot of fun, thanks for watching, please subscribe to watch more, see you soon!